Greetings, you are watching Automotive Territory. It is hard to say what exact features of fat bicycles attract buyers, be it baddest motorcycle look of fat tires, extra cushioning, off-road readiness or just the willingness of riders to send out, but it's obvious that they are getting more and more popular with each cycling season. However, if riding a fat bike paddling with one's legs could be tough due to some extra weight, electric motors easily solve this problem. Today we'll present you the best fat electric bicycles currently on sale that can climb mountains, will tackle curbs unnoticed and make you look like the toughest rider in the town. But before we get there, subscribe to our channel not to miss any of the new episodes about electric transport and the automotive world. And the last thing, ring the bell to get notified about the new releases. Enjoy the ride! E-Stallion E-Stallion is a rather new brand on the market of electric fat bikes, founded in 2017 in Germany. But regardless of its young age, it stands out from the crowd due to the beautiful design, high-quality components, great performance characteristics and all sorts of accessories, custom-built for the bike directly by the manufacturer. Available trim levels of E-Stallion are basic, high and high plus. The starter model is stripped down of the front suspension and gets a 250-watt motor while the upper ones get front fork from the factory and motors up to 750 watt. The battery, which is installed under the rider's seats, can reach 1140 watt hour capacity, which converts into 47 miles of uninterrupted riding using throttle only, or up to 87 miles when paddling with motor assistance. Italian fat bike is as handsome as they get, with integrated lights and wires, leather handles and seats, along with bright color options. Super 73 from Lithium Cycles The Canadian-based company Lithium Cycles was founded back in 2011 as a manufacturer of industrial cars and scooters. However, after the tremendous success of the 2016 Super 73 electric bicycle, they became primarily associated with this product. The design of this two-wheeler is reminiscent of the iconic 1970s mini motorbikes with a classic banana seat. The original model is currently the priciest, sold at $2,800, and the lightweight 73Z, which actually has the more down-to-earth cost of $950, is the cheapest. Depending on your needs, there are four trims in total, with various motor power, top speed, range, payload and set of accessories. Bear in mind though that Super 73 bicycles do not have pedal assist riding capability, you either throttle or paddle. But since the range reaches 20 to 40 miles on a charge, you might end up getting sweaty only on a rare occasions. Red Rover Fat Bikes Within the last couple of years, Red Power Bikes has risen to become one of the most recognized affordable electric bicycles manufacturers on the market. In 2018, they offer a completely redesigned lineup built from the ground up, taking into consideration the experience and feedback collected from thousands of buyers. Models feature brand new frame designs and color schemes, a new and improved battery that is compatible across all models, and even more robust components and line of accessories. Red Fat Bicycles are represented by Red Rover and Red Mini, both priced at $1500 MSRP. The engineers upgraded battery packs to the new 48V 14Ah with Samsung 35E cells, rated for 800 charge cycles. The powerful rear-mounted 750W Befang-geared hub motor ensures 20 mph top speed, and the range reaches 25 to 45 miles per hour depending on the style of riding and weight of the owner. Front and rear lights are integrated, front suspension is a standard, and LCD display will let you know everything about the ride. So all in all, the red fat bikes are a perfect package. Fat Bikes from Saunders you have probably heard of the Saunders Electric Bicycles Company as the enterprise that managed to successfully crowdfund the development and production of the most affordable electrified bicycle on the market. Quite some time has passed since then, and the lineup of Saunders has drastically increased, as well as the loyal community of riders. At the moment, the fat bikes lineup by this manufacturer includes five models. Sanders Original, that served as the pioneer with its 60 pound 17.75 inches one size fits most frame, 350 watt motor, 20 page top speed, and 20 to 40 miles range. Sanders Stainless, that adds stainless steel components and larger battery. And the top of the line Sanders X, that is a standard, offers front suspension, more powerful 500 watt motor, and a larger battery. 
Moreover, fans of folding bikes can also shop at this US manufacturer's website, choosing from Sanders Fold and Fold X, which differ by motor power and battery capacity. All in all, with Sanders you get rather basic e-bikes, which however come at a very affordable price, and they do work. Unimoke Originally started as a simple e-bike rental business on Mallorca, Urban Drive Style quickly grew into something entirely different. Responding to a huge demand for reliable and powerful bikes that could be ridden off-road, the company developed their own and launched an Indiegogo campaign selling over 200 vehicles worldwide in early 2017. Since then it has been relocated to Berlin and developed a more universal, road-legal, all-purpose bike, naming it Unimoke. The vehicle is sold in two motor options, with continuous power ranging from 200 watts to 750 watts. Unimoke's range is around 25 miles on a charge, but it can vary depending on the rider's weight, terrain and pedal assist level. The bike requires no license or registration to be operated in the EU and Australia, but it has its speed electronically limited to 15 miles per hour to meet current legislation. Higher speeds are available on demand if the bike will be used at private properties only. If you're still with us, you must be really determined to learn about the electric fat bicycles. Or maybe even buy one. Some of these are sold on Amazon, and others directly from the manufacturer's websites. We're gonna leave the links in the description, so follow those prior to placing an order to support our channel. Let's keep rolling! Scrambler from Juiced Bikes Just recently, Juiced Bikes presented a new line of powerful electric bicycles with classic scrambler design for off-road and on-road use. The company launched the campaign on Indiegogo, featuring three new models – Camp, City and Hyper Scrambler. The first two bikes have similar performance characteristics but different tires, and wheels are equipped with a 750-watt motor and a 7-speed Shimano transmission that pulls power from 780-watt-hour battery. Both develop the max speed of 28 mph. Hyper Scrambler, on the other hand, features a 1,100-watt motor, a 990-watt-hour battery, and real-time GPS tracking. Its top speed goes as high as 34 miles per hour off-road, but is limited to 28 mph for road legal use. All models have integrated LCD display, LED headlight, speed limiter, and cruise control for speeds under 20 miles per hour. At the moment, they are available for pre-order, with an early bird discount at the price of $1,500. Patago Trail Tracker Riding on 4-inch wide tires, this fat bike is suitable to be ridden by adults and kids alike. It is sold in three options with the regular 26-inch and smaller 20 and 24-inch wheels. The bike has sleek design with black matte frame and colorful rims. Its lightweight and long-lasting lithium battery with Samsung cells is integrated into the frame and can be charged on or off the bike. The Trail Tracker has five levels of pedal assist with the top speed reaching 20 miles per hour. For the kid-friendly 20-inch bike, the top speed is limited to 12 mph. Patagos Power comes from a 500-watt geared rear-mounted motor that is paired with the top-notch Shimano 7-speed. For improved control and safety, the bike is equipped with a front light, USB charging port and LCD display that reflects your speed, mileage, riding mode and battery life. Swagtron EB6 Youth This company offers all kinds of last-mile transportation vehicles and electric city transport, including hoverboards, scooters, skateboards and bikes. Swagtron's folding bikes are probably the most known for their rear designs. However, there is one fat bicycle in the lineup as well. The EB6 is compact and would be ideal for women or youth, with its 20 by 4 inch tires. The installed 350-watt hub motor allows for both battle assist and throttle riding, as well as free coasting. The current price is just $800, placing it in the category of the cheapest e-bikes. It is worth noting, though, that this company was previously known as Swagway, and it received very bad publicity because some of their hoverboards were spontaneously catching on fire. However, since then it seems that they put their act together and no accidents were reported. Fat Bikes from Volt Bike The British Columbia, Canada-based Volt Bike Company was started with an idea to bring to North America premium electric bike at half a price. Though still not the most affordable model out there, the customer satisfaction rating and rich standard package do make Volt Bikes rather appealing. 
Fat bikes from the cycle maker are named Yukon and Mariner, the former one being a full-size two-wheeler with 26-inch tires and the latter a 20-inch wheel compact folding bike. These vehicles get equipped with 500 to 750 watt Bifang motors and batteries with either Samsung or Panasonic cells. Tactra front and rear disc brakes and Kenda tires ensure maximum control and stability. As a standard, you will get front and rear lights, and Mariner even gets fenders in a cargo rack. While to get you can equip with this gear, you will have to throw in another 100 bucks. 7 Day City Built by the Italian design team under the company named Fantic, this e-bike is definitely more good-looking than most of the fat bikes sold today. It has premium quality leather seat and honey-colored grips, black and beige 4-inch white tires with surprisingly matching leather-like look, neat control display and a cargo rack. In addition to being aesthetically appealing, 7 Day City has enough power to compare it to the company's sport bike and can last for day-long cruises. The bike is equipped with 250-watt mid-mounted motor from the leading German manufacturer Bros, 10-speed transmission, hydraulic brakes and a BMC lithium-ion battery with a two-year warranty. To accommodate any customer, it comes in three aluminum frame size options – S, M and L. 7 Day City is currently sold in many dealerships across Western Europe and California in the US. High Bike Exduro Full Fat 6 Famous for building regular bicycles for off-road and road use since 1995, High Bike first ventured into creating a production e-bike about 8 years ago. Today the company offers over 20 different electric vehicles within two main lines, Extreme Focused X-Duro and Sporty S-Duro. One of them is the X-Duro Full Fat 6 that has truly top-of-the-line performance and equipment. Its motor, battery, charger and LCD X screen come from Yamaha. Chain and transmission are sourced from Shimano, brakes are Megura, and stem, grips, handlebar and wheel hubs are company-made. The bike features a 250-watt motor paired with an 11-speed transmission and its power comes from a lithium-ion 500-watt hour battery. It comes in three frame sizes, with a max weight capacity of 265 pounds. Unlike many competitors, this high bike has Bluetooth, a GPS transmitter and a GSM chip that are used for route recording and emergency tracking, as well as theft detection. Cyrusher Fat Tire Bikes The name of this company is a combination of cycling and rusher, which is intended to mean the pioneering position in the cycling sports. Cyrusher is based in Shenzhen, China. However, their products are widely sold on Amazon with good reviews from buyers. The fat lineup includes 500 watt and up to 1 kW strong bikes, powered by rear-mounted hub motors. The juice comes from a removable and waterproof Samsung 48V 10.4Ah lithium water bottle battery with over 500 times recharge cycles. Cyrusher e-bike has an aluminum frame keeping the weight at bay. The front suspension fork smoothens the bumps on the road and dual disc brakes ensure reliable stopping power, which you will definitely need if your bicycle can accelerate to 25mph. The starter modification is priced at $1600, while the upper trims go to the $2200 mark, offering full suspension, more power and hydraulic brakes. Just a reminder to follow those links in the description if you want to buy any of these bikes and support our channel at the same time. We suggest watching other episodes of Automotive Territory about various EVs. The links are on the screen and info cards. Subscribe and ring the bell not to miss any of the upcoming content. May the torque be with you!